Plittens, Heart Bay 45 here, and welcome back to another story time with Harley Baby. I figured the perfect story time to do right now, since it is currently raining uh, as of filming this, uh, a story of how I became really, really afraid of thunder and lightning, as I itch my nose. So this started when I was a little, when I was a kid. Um, I was just laying in bed, sleeping. I can't remember if it was on a school night or not. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but it is raining really hard outside right now. So it was raining super hard one night, and I was just sleeping, and all of a sudden, I kind of see a flash, which means lightning had gotten off, and then I hear the big crash of thunder. So I run out of my room, and I go into the living room where my parents are, and I'm just like super spooked, and they're like, it's okay, it's just like a science thing that's happening. I'm just like, but it's still scary because it was loud, they like, I know. So I was able to calm down and go back to sleep. Well, as of last night, I was actually uh, trying to go to sleep, and it was raining pretty hard, as it is now. And, all, and you know, thunder and lightning had been going off, but it wasn't super loud. It was something I can probably easily handle. And then there was a huge crash of thunder that happened, and I was just like, nope, not okay. So I went into the living room, sat out with my dad for a bit, and my mom woke up to the to the thunder going off. She goes, if you need to come in here, you know, you can. So I just sat out with my dad for a few minutes watching TV, and then after a little while, it kind of just either stopped raining altogether, or it just kind of just really, really died down. But ever since I was a kid, you know, big crashes of thunder like that really scare me. It gives me really, it gives me really, really anxious, and I do not like it. I would literally clutch a stuffy and hide under the covers. So that was my story time for today. I know it was short and sweet, but um, this is just how I became afraid of thunder and lightning when I was a kid, and it still carries on into my adulthood. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me, uh, leave me a comment down below. Are you afraid of the thunder and lightning, or do you find it scientifically fascinating? I would love to know. Thank you so much for watching, Puddins. I love you.